Greetings and welcome. I'm Sharon Ahuna. I'm the coordinator of our summer learning program, and it's my pleasure to welcome you to the summer school graduation and commencement program for the graduating class of 2019. Today is a very special day for these young people. They've prepared, they've persevered, and they are ready to graduate and have this celebration today. The KCPS School District recognizes them and they are ready to graduate and I welcome you this afternoon to this ceremony. Uh, this morning I was actually thinking about a story that I heard a couple years ago when I had a graduating class and uh, it was, I was reminded of it this morning. I want to tell you it's very, very short. Um, today is not just a special day, but it's a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity. There are a lot of things in life that I, I heard this story and it's, like I said, touched me a little bit. There's a lot of things in life we can do more than once. Um, today is something you will never, ever do again. People in this audience will look at you different after today. Uh, sometimes we can, we can graduate college, but we can do that more than once. You can get married. Hopefully you will. But as we know, we can do that more than once. Right? Um, but high school graduation is something you will never do more than one time. So it's a very exciting day today. We're proud of you. Kansas City, Missouri Public Schools is proud of you. Your parents and family are proud of you. And we're excited to celebrate this with you this morning. Uh, a couple of housekeeping things for us this morning. I kindly ask that you shut your cell phones on to silent, please. We don't want any ringing during our ceremony. Um, I also ask that you stay seated during our ceremony the entire time. We want every graduate to enjoy and also be able to hear their name as they cross the stage. Um, at this time, I would also ask you to stand for our national anthem. I'd like to take a moment to introduce our distinguished guest that we have on stage this morning, Dr. Mark Bedell, Superintendent of Schools. Dr. Lawan Johnson, Associate Principal of Anderson. And Mr. Christopher Green, Summer School Principal of Northeast High School. At this time, I'd like to invite Dr. Johnson, who will be our keynote speaker this morning, to the stage. Good morning. Good morning. I'm going to keep this quick and short. Gift, a thing given willingly to someone without payment, a natural ability or talent. I am here to stir up your gift. Don't pursue your passion, pursue your gift. Eagles, your gift is to soar high while looking down saying, game on. Soar above the obstacles that hinders your destiny. Set your sight on successful surviving life. Use your understanding of your gifts and ability to accomplish 
amazing things. Bears, your gift is to be the game changers of life. You have the ability to create a path to change the world. Stay fierce and strong while protecting your gifts on your journey. Vikings, your gift is to fight because you are built for this. Your ability to stay the course allows you the victory to fight with vigor and honor for justice. Knights, your gift is to be all in for honor. Adhere to what is right, respect, integrity, and honesty. People will hold you in great esteem. Execute your plan utilizing your gift to uphold saving the bears, eagles, phoenix, vikings, and the many others who look to you to defend them. Defending with your whole armor, not allowing any gift to lie dormant. Phoenix, your gift is to continue to press through. Press through the trials, rough times, sickness, and disappointments. But wait, all of this pressing allows you to rise above adversity because it's your time. Open your mouth and share your extraordinary gifts that are within you. The hidden talents that no one knew about. Dust off the cobwebs of life and bring forth the light that shines through the darkness. To all graduates, as I close, your gifts allow you to live your life on your terms because it's your time. Your time to soar into becoming the game changers of life because you are built for this. Knowing without a shadow of doubt that you are all in. To the eagles, bears, vikings, knights, and phoenix, now it's our time to release you to share your gifts that you possess to serve the world to the fullest. Leaving behind a generation of wealthy ideals, talents, businesses, and interventions. Create a roadmap of love, joy, peace, happiness, and hope for a successful living on your journey. Thank you. Dr. Bedell, will you please join me at the podium? <clears throat> On the behalf of the faculty of the Quest Summer School Program, it is my honor to present to you the 2019 candidates for graduation. These students have met all district and straight graduate, state graduation requirements to be considered a graduate of the class of 2019. Dr. Bedell, do you accept these graduates of the Kansas City, Missouri Public School District? I do. So to our graduating seniors, I want to start off by, as I stated to you out in the hallway, hallway thanking you for continuing to persevere. And the thing that I like to tell people when I speak is like you see an end product of a long journey when you look at me. But my journey is no different than these students and many of the other students that we serve. You see, I didn't take a traditional route to graduate out of high school. I too fell into some hard times as I matriculated through. I made decisions that were not not necessarily in the best interest of myself, but then there were also variables 
that come with life that sometimes our students have to encounter and they have to overcome. And despite those variables, you see nine students here or eight students who are here today that did not allow for that to stop them from reaching their potential. What this does now, everybody, is it opens up the doors. And I come from a family where I'm the only one out of eight to make it past the ninth grade. I know what it looks like when you do not have a high school diploma and how far you will be able to move in life. These students now that they are moving forward with the next phase of their life, it opens up doors beyond belief. And here's the last thing I will say before we get to the certification. What people will not do is when you go and apply for a job or you apply for trade school or the military or if you decide to move on to college, nobody will say, hey, did you graduate in four years? Did you graduate and walk with your class? Nobody's gonna ask that question. Nobody asked that of me. I went to night school my whole senior year because of the struggles. I'm here right now as a superintendent. They don't ask those questions. They ask, what is it that you have and what is it that you bring to the table? So ultimately, having this degree is just the beginning of it all, but now it's about a body of work. And your body of work needs to do the talking for you. The high school degree, degree can take you only so far. Now it's for you to get out here and show everybody, this is what I bring to the table and this is going to be my value add. So let's move on. So at this time, I certify that these seniors have met all of the requirements set forth by the Kansas City Public School Board in the state of Missouri. By the power vested in me, I hereby declare you graduates of the Kansas City Public School District. All right, let's move to the show. Presentation of our graduates. Khalifa Doolin. Tyree Greer. Deanna Miller. Congratulations, Emmanuel Montanero Velasio. Adriana Ortiz. Brian Owsley. <laughs> Kelly Robinson. All right, everybody, that's it. Congratulations. Congratulations. Before we close this afternoon's ceremony, I'd like to take the opportunity to say on behalf of the faculty, staff, and administration of KCPS, congratulations to both the graduates, families who have helped them arrive at this moment. Um, graduates, it's clear that you've prepared yourself and you deserve to take pride in this day. At this point in time, you can turn your tassels. All right. All right. Thank you, and have a wonderful afternoon.